I'm Matt Fresh. Hope you guys are having an amazing freaking day. Gonna get you back to California for the old PB tour videos. Thanks so much for the feedback so far on those videos. Glad you guys are liking them. Wanna let you know real quick before we head a couple thousand miles westward. We're back in the Omeha, as you guys can tell. This video is sponsored by Mystery Tackle Box. If you're not familiar with Mystery Tackle Box, it's a subscription tackle service that sends one of these sexy boxes to your house every single month full of some of your favorite tackles, some brand new tackle you've never seen, and some exclusive tackle you cannot get anywhere else. Also want to let you know, if you click the link down below and use my promo code SLAUNCH, that's S-L-A-U-N-C-H, you'll get your very first mystery tackle box for as little as five freaking dollars. Oh, also, I'm going to give away a, a box to one of you lucky MFers uh, at the end of this video, so stay tuned to the end of the video. I'll let you know the, uh, the steps so you can be entered in this little giveaway right here. That way, one of you guys can enjoy this box and go catch some fish. All right, let's go to California. Lake of the Clear. Morning MFers. Uh, I don't know what time it is when you're watching this video, but it is definitely morning here. We woke up at three o'clock this morning and we're hitting a different bite window. Actually, some things lined up this morning. Um, first thing in the morning, it's, it's gonna rain today, so we've got some storms coming in about 10 o'clock and talk to Oliver. Um, that's what I'm here with, if you haven't seen the previous videos. Oliver thinks it's gonna be a good morning bite today. So we woke up about three this morning, drove three hours. We are at a bucket list location that I've wanted to fish my entire life, Clear Lake, California. Now the bite's apparently been pretty damn tough, so it, it could be some trials and tribulations, kinda like it has been so far. But like I said, we're, we got the, the feeding windows lining up and everything like that. And we got some big baits and some other types of bait. We got all types of things tied up. We actually might be doing something different today than we're going to be doing the other days. And that is going for some of the trophy crappie that live in here. Two, three, even four pound crappie in this lake. So let's get her launched, see what the hell happens. I'm gonna start with the jerk and snatch then. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, those are not carp. No? No. Oh, they're blown bait. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Hey, I watch your fishing videos a lot and I would like to start my own channel and get paid for it. So can you tell me how to get started? The end. One sentence, no punctuation. Well, first, you gotta fish every day for 25 years and spend every dime you have on it. Right? <laughs> It's easy. There's that part. There's that. When you get done with that, the internet won't exist anymore. Oh, oh. Don't swing. Why? I did for a second. It felt like a crappie, by the way. Before you were fishing. Oh, uh, look at that. Oh, oh, oh. There you go. Oh, <laughs> that's a big old crap. <laughs> yep. Yep. We found them. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's dude. That's the biggest crappie I've ever caught. I think. Hey, you know, this is big crappie dreams right here, baby. Do you flip them? No, they're pretty heavy. Dude, that is insane. So, what? The f <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> that's welcome disgusting. Look at the back on that. How much does this dude weigh? Uh, that's gonna be close to two, if not two. We can weigh it if you like. Oh my god. But I have a feeling you might catch a bigger one. That is giant. Go pick that ass. That's a beast. Ugh. That's Just had to steal your underspin. What are you going to throw now? Damn, dude, that sucks you gave me this. <laughs> Never putting it down again. All right, well, bass fishing has not gone the way we've wanted it. They've been sneaky, but we just came out here. Thanks to the old live scope, Oliver saw some craps. And I caught my biggest crappie ever, and it wasn't even one of the giant, giant ones. Okay, guess we'll do this for a little bit. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah, we got better. All in the backpack. <laughs> uh, How you like them apples, huh? Let's get the f out of here. We're out of here. I gotta go pee, and then I'm, <laughs> I'm ready. Here, huh? Since you suck at fishing and can't catch a bass, one of the best bass fisheries in the country, besides Leanne, of course, I'm gonna weigh my, my probably my personal best crappie since 
bass fish don't bite. At least I got this Mondasaur. It's tough to tell Whoa. how big this guy is until you see the back region. Let's give him away. One. Oh. Ah. Did you do it? No, I didn't. One fourteen. Just shy. Didn't get a two pounder. Two ounces short. It's a tank. Get him back in. It's pounding fourteen ounces bigger than any bass I caught so far today. Let's go catch a giant bass. Okay. Drop that work up in the bushes. Hope them boys don't see my stash. If they do tell the truth, this the last time you might see my ass. Okay, little mental refresher situation. Made a couple hour drive. We are now at Lake of the Berryessa again, where I caught my big swim bait fish the other day. Not giant swim bait fish, but a decent one. Um, weather conditions are much different. It is no longer raining. It's kind of like partly cloudy. Quite a bit more wind and the water is pretty clear here. They say it's cleaning every single day. Um, this is a lake where Oliver said there is upper teens in this lake. Giant, 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 giant fish. Big smallmouth, big spots. A little bit of everything. I'm not willing to concede to just trying to catch fish at this point yet. Still going to throw the big bait around and uh, yeah, hopefully get you guys some footage of Giant. This is the PB tour after all, so let's go make that happen. This is the spot to do it. That's the boat to do it on. We just got to execute. Alright, what's the uh, terms of engagement here? What's on the line? What are you betting for? Biggest fish? First fish? Last fish? Biggest for sure. Last fish? <laughs> Biggest fish, huh? Alright, I'll take that as odds. Whoever catches it has to buy dinner. Fair enough. And everybody wins. Ooh. Get bumped? That or a tree. Oh, I got. Oh, you... How far did that tree come out? Pretty far. Might have been that then. Ooh. Oh, that's a G, I am. Wasn't bad one. Body spot. Did I have one too? No, there's a carp. <laughs> For sure, how to bite. <laughs> yeah. There's one right there. Oh, look at that adjustment. What'd you find? Uh-oh. She, she, she might have right been now. a better one, I think. It looks like it. Uh, nope, oh, it's not. Her. It's not at all. Get him! <laughs> Woo! Nice little hybrid guy you got there, eh? Uh -huh. Well, let's call it a day. Leanne's buying dinner. Yeah, that was easy. I thought you had a bad idea. <laughs> We're going to Rudy's tonight. We're out of here. Fillet mignons and lobsters. Cruise horse. Okay, we might have found the fish. Who's Smalley? Smallmouth. Straight up smallmouth back here? That's odd. That's what you do, huh? <laughs> Draw them in with it? I'm serious. That's interesting. What do I know, though? Yeah, that's a good point. Hey, look, it didn't break. You didn't break your rod or anything? Wow. This is badass back here. Species number two. That was a hook set. Get him. Baby guy. Baby That's probably the one that hook dun, 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 bit dun. me. Hey, we got the trifecta already today. The try in a half hour. We're good. Oh my God. Oh. Okay. Wow. Oh, dude, they're building underneath the freaking trolling motor. <laughs> and there. <laughs> and there. On the scopey of lives. Oh, that was a big one, dude. That was a big one. Uh, <laughs> that was... Dude, that was a tank. It was fighting different. I almost dude. threw up when that came off. Projectile. <laughs> Has anyone ever done that in your boat when they lost a big swim bait fish? <laughs> uh, very few guys have lost swim bait fish, thankfully. Most of them end up in the boat. That's good. Mm, mm, mm. Pretty good one. Get him out of there. Real, 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 real. You can come and stand there you there. go. Largey, spotty, largey. How to bite? On the dock crawler. I need to put something finesse on. No, I don't. Greetings. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. Mm, tank, dude. That's gonna be a bass. That's a bass. Dang it. Ooh, it's a smallie. Look at those brown ones. Dang, dude. That's the biggest smallie we've caught. It's not a bad one. It's not a bad smallie at all. What the hell are you doing up here? What's up, little buddy? Oh, man. All the species is fishing for crappie. 
smaller than some of the crappie you've caught, I think. <laughs> Sweet. All right, most of the way throughout the day. It's been a tough day. Um, kind of committed to the big bait the entire time, and it's been mostly little bait stuff that's gotten the majority of the bites. I think Leanne whooped us once again today. She's back, she was throwing the side chick rig we showed you yesterday, the Texas, not Texas, the Carolina rigged little tiny swim bait. Today she's giving them the little, what do you call this, Oliver, the ding dong? That is the infamous dot crawler. The sneaky dot crawler. She whooped us again. And then Oliver has been catching freaking fish on the little tiny underspin, fishing for crappie and catching big fish. I've been throwing the Defiant most of the day. Um, switched around to some smaller stuff a little bit, but it's been it's crazy. Two extremes, big baits, small baits. We're gonna hit a couple more points, like the one right back here behind us. We just hit it. We're gonna go hit a couple more. And then uh, crawling of the day. Hasn't been the successful day, but you guys saw what happened at the end of the day last time. So hopefully we can do the same. where we did not get my PB. It wasn't for a lack of trying. Freaking threw the big bait around. Again, more than you guys probably saw. I don't know how much of me casting a big lure without catching one you guys want to see, but uh, yeah, threw it a whole bunch. Blanked again on it. First day I was there, caught a, a solid fish on it, um, and since then had not had a bite. This is the third day in a row. So part of the gamble. I mean, you can throw finesse baits all day, you can get bit, or you can throw the big bait all day and hope for a eight to 15 even higher pound bass. Honestly, right now in Nebraska and for the rest of the year, I can go catch those small fish when I want to, but we're kind of capped out at like the, the six or seven pound mark. There's a couple bigger than that, but that's uh, that's like it. The state record here in Nebraska is only 10 pounds. So my goal for the trip was to go catch a big bass. I'm gonna keep throwing the big baits to catch a big bass. And we have one day left to do it. All right, some of you guys are probably wondering how you can win the Mystery Tackle Box Pro Box. Um, very simple, three simple steps. I'd first, go hit the like button, the thumbs up button right now. Second, drop a comment right down below. And third, go subscribe to Melican Fishing. The way it works is one week from today, I'm gonna use a random comment generator to pick one of you lucky MFers down in the comments down below. I'm gonna make sure you're subscribed to Melican Fishing and then I'm gonna get your information and send this box to you guys right there. That way you guys can enjoy a free mystery tackle box. If you want to try it, like I said, super easy to go try it. Hit the link, use promo code Solange. Get it really, really cheap to, uh, to get you started there. I strongly recommend doing that because this comes with some really badass tackle that helps me stock up every month and try a whole bunch of new bits as well. Anyways, thanks so much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. I'm out of here. Peace. I'm not sorry. I can't help this love like mine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sorry. I can't stop with a love like mine